everyone welcome back to my channel hope you're all doing well today I am unboxing the November Sephora play this is my favorite subscription I get so excited when I see this black and white box delivered I don't even want to wait let's dive in and see what I got so like all the other boxes this is what the box looks like I think it's really cute and it's a nice sturdy box for you to use for storage you can organize your makeup in this I actually use it for a couple of perfumes that I have back here I love these boxes boxes now inside let's see this is what it looks like inside you get that booklet this says the exclusives Ooh, I wonder what that's all about if you haven't seen any of my other unboxings I'll definitely link those below my format is I dive right in and then I look up in the book that product if there's sometimes little tips or some information if I'm not familiar with it well let me see I'm not gonna look just gonna grab the first thing and the first thing I have, ooh, this is awesome. It's the Buxom Full On Lip Cream. I have, I think the Plumping Lip Gloss already, and I can't remember what the shade, it is a pale pink, and this is in the shade Dolly. Oh, these, I think this is a very popular shade too. I always hear people rave about it. That's the packaging. I really think Buxom does a good job on their packaging. They're these I think this is plastic, but it feels almost like glass. It's kind of that frosted glass look. I think that these value sample sizes are really nice. It's just enough to, you know, throw in your purse. It will still last a long time. So I really like these deluxe sample sizes. Doe foot applicator, really typical of most lip creams, lip glosses. And this looks like a fairly sheer pink, but I like that. And it does smell a little minty. I know the other ones have that tinglingness. So this does say it's plumping, so I'm sure. Yep, refreshing sensation. It says right on the side of the box. Let's look in the book. I think this is a great shade. You leave it in your purse. It's no fuss, everyday kind of thing. I love that. Already, this box is awesome. So it says, get the look of fuller lips with this creamy, glass-smooth, plumping gloss in a universally flattering, shimmer-free pink shade. I love the shimmer-free aspect of it. I think that's awesome. Love this already. Let's see what the next thing is. Ooh, okay. This is This box has already been the best with these two products. This is a Bite Beauty product, which I love Bite Beauty. I have the Agave Lip Mask always right here in front of me because I use it all the time. And this is the High Pigment Lip Pencil. I've never, ooh, that's a pretty shade. It's in the color Rhubarb, just from the little swatch there that shows the color. I love these products because they're all natural. I believe they're all made from food products, so they're pretty much edible. I don't know, not like you would eat your lip products, but I think that's really nice. They have the cutest packaging. It's always this nice matte gray kind of rubbery feel, and I like that color a lot. Let's see. Oh, so it says it's a high pigment lip pencil. So it's just like a little lip crayon. That's a gorgeous shade. Another beautiful everyday. Oh, that is a perfect mauve shade. Wow. I like that. Really pigmented, seems really moisturizing, almost like a satin finish. This, again, keep in your purse. Beautiful already. I'm telling you, I love this subscription. Let's see in the book if they say anything interesting about the product. So in the book, they have that picture there. Getting the perfect application of concentrated modern color is a simple is simple with this creamy, antioxidant-rich lip pencil. Love this. So cute. I love, oh, okay. I've said I love this about a thousand times, but you know that I'm a big fan of this box. Next thing is, oh, it's a little, I think this is a little eyeliner. It's the Sephora brand. It is just a uh, waterproof eye crayon. It has the plastic wrapping, so Lord knows I'll either chip my nail polish, break a nail, just to get into this tiny little thing. Okay. It's a really gorgeous blue shade. Like a royal blue, does it have the color on here? I don't see the color, but I'll give it a swatch. That's really pretty. Look at that gorgeous blue. That will look really nice if you use a nice royal blue shade in your waterline and your eyes are kind of bloodshot or red, it actually makes them look whiter because 
blue and red um, cancel out each other. So that's just a little tip for you, but that seems really pigmented and creamy. I think that will be a nice pencil. I've never tried the Sephora pencils before. It says it's waterproof. Wearing blue eyeliner doesn't have to scream 80s. Get just a hint of eye-catching color by laying this bold blue over black eyeliner. Helen Phillips, she's a Sephora Pro artist. This is a little quote from her. There that is. I like that. Let's move on to the next thing. And it looks like a perfume. It's the Stella McCart McCartney. I almost said McCarthy. Um, Stella McCartney um, sample of... I think it's just called Stella. I've gotten a sample of this before. So I like, I do like having these little samples because you can just keep them, again, in your purse. It's easy to travel with, so that's really nice. And the last thing, ooh, okay. This, I think out of every single box I've gotten, this has been my favorite because this next item is the Josie Marin Pure Argan Oil. This stuff's expensive and it's very nice. From what I've heard, I've never tried it before, but again, a good size for a sample, you'll definitely, get a lot of use out of that. Doesn't have a smell, but argan oil is great. You can mix it in with your foundations. You can use this as a skincare product. I think that's awesome. Let's see if they have anything in the book about it. Here it is in the book. These illustrations are very nice as well. And let's see, this pure organic argan oil absorbs quickly and goes on light, making it one of its nature's best multitaskers for restoring balance and nourishing all skin types. And the last thing in here, another awesome product, it's the Makeup Forever Primers. This is the Step 1 Skin Equalizer. It's the Hydrating Primer. I've wanted to try these since they came out, but just didn't really want to spend a lot of money on a primer, and I'm excited that I got this little guy. So that's the Hydrating Primer, and I think that will be perfect. Coming into the winter, I tend to get a little drier, dehydrated. It's always nice to have that hydrating barrier between your foundation so things don't look cakey or dry or flaky. This person, again, Helen Phillips, says, I love to make the little of this primer into foundation. It creates sheer coverage that is perfect for that kind of casual day look. Great tip. It's another reason why I love these little booklets you get because you get some ideas, you learn about the product. I think it's great that they include that in there. That was the box. Wow, I am highly impressed with this box and I love every single thing in it. I cannot believe how awesome this is. I'm excited, can you tell I'm excited? And that's it for my box. I give this two two thumbs up. Out of all the ones I've got, I think this is my third box. I think that's right. I think this is my third box and this one is my favorite. Every single one of these things is amazing. Let me know if you are subscribed to the Sephora Play Box and if you're enjoying your products, especially this month, let me know. And if you like this video and Sephora Play, these unboxings, all of that, don't forget to give the video a big thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed, you know where that button lives. Thank you so much for joining me and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.